Hello, it's me, Joe, again. I've been writing a blog and making YouTube videos in a sort of higgledy-piggledy manner over uh, quite a few years now. Um, it hasn't been done with a, any particular focus or intent, really, until now. I'm starting to produce stuff a bit more regularly and with a little bit more thought. But for some reason, uh, a few different people have sent me products uh, with a view to me uh, reviewing them. For, just in case, I suppose, I like it and um, wanted to put a word in and help them publicise themselves. And a couple of people have sent me things and uh, I'm somebody who will tend to just say what I think, so I haven't always done uh, positive reviews. Um, but uh, one thing was sent to me a couple of years ago. Uh, a guy from a company called Risk Grips got in touch with me and uh, offered to send me one of their items for people with wrist pain. And at the time I said, fine, go ahead, send me your thingamajig and I'll try it out, in which they um, very kindly did. And I, I've had a few minor uh, twinges of, of pain here and there over the years of playing. Um, but I didn't have anything really serious at the time, so I received this thing, this is it here, um, and uh, kind of I tried it on for a little little bit and uh, I didn't, didn't really uh, get any impression of it one way or the other and put it away uh, and kind of forgot about it. Um, but more recently, um, I've, I've been doing a lot of technical exercises uh, for the last couple of years and um, for, for whatever reason, I've developed a little bit of tendonitis or RSI possibly and uh, around um, the new year, this is the... Uh, now we're in early 2021, January, uh, so uh, the very end of 2020, um, I developed quite a, a lot of pain in my wrist. Uh, so it became uh, painful enough that I stopped practicing uh, at least a, a chunk of my exercises um, and really um, kind of reduced the amount of drumming I did for a little while. I, I normally practice for a couple of hours every day and uh, I, I stopped practicing altogether for a couple of weeks and gave it some rest and so on, but it was really painful and I had to uh, relax. And uh, I remembered that I had this thing stashed away somewhere and I rummaged around in all my boxes and found it. And this is the, the wrist grips, wrist grip thing. Um, it's a, basically a strap made of uh, nylon, I guess, with some uh, Velcro on it. There's the logo. It's got a metal sort of buckle here. And um, it's very straightforward, isn't it? It almost seems silly I'm demonstrating this, but um, you just put it on your hand like so. Uh, tighten it firmly according to the instructions. Obviously not so firmly that you cut off the blood and your hand falls off, but you just secure it like that. Um, and so I went and found the thing and uh, stuck it on my wrist and thought, OK, let's see if this thing works. Uh, and pff, somewhat surprisingly, because uh, a lot of things don't, um, but it's really, really helped my wrist pain. So I thought I'd make a video about this because uh, a lot of people get um, wrist pain, especially musicians, whether drummers, uh, guitarists, pianists, uh, any kind of musicians. It's, uh, you know, all these movements are very strenuous. Um, the way this works, as far as I understand it, bearing in mind I have no medical knowledge whatsoever, I've got no idea what's going on under the skin really, but apparently by compressing uh, the joint here, it helps to relieve pain and, and aids the healing of whatever uh, ugly shenanigans are going on underneath there with our tendons and muscles and whatnot. Um, and um, within a few days of um, wearing this thing, uh, I felt an improvement and I've worn it most of the day, pretty much every day. Uh, now we're in uh, sort of mid to late January, so I've been wearing for a good three weeks and it's improved a lot to the extent that now if I'm not wearing it, um, I can practice gently and not getting much pain at all. It feels a lot better. Um, bearing in mind, I'm being very careful as well, so I am uh, uh, I've de-intensified a lot of what I'm doing. Um, I'm also sort of massaging this area of my arm and trying to loosen up my shoulder because I think that's where the tightness sort of originates that causes uh, strain here. Uh, again, I have no qualification to say that. It's just my own impression about this. I don't have access to a sports therapist or anything like that. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to say, if you feel like uh, you have wrist pain and you're looking for some sort of solution, I would try out one of these wrist grip things. It's helped me a lot. Uh, and not just to 
uh, very quickly relieve the pain I was experiencing at the time, but also it seems to have uh, helped to make it generally better. Uh, it doesn't get in the way, so if I am playing, uh, I can wear this, it's pretty comfortable. I'm, I'm obviously aware of it being on my hand, but um, it's, it's, uh, it seems to be pretty um, easy to get used to. So, uh, highly recommend it. I uh, even went as far as to buy myself a packet, a pair of these, because I only had the one and I thought it might be useful to have two, have a spare, whatever. Uh, it's not that easy to get in the UK. On Amazon, you can get them, but there's like a massive uh, postal charge for some reason. Um, so I ended up buying these from Toman, uh, which is in Germany. And I was only half expected to receive them, actually, because, uh, you know, Brexit and all that. But, uh, yep, yeah, seems to have got through and it was only 25 quid, which, you know, not too bad. Anyway, uh, highly recommended wrist grips. If you have wrist pain, uh, it's really worth the punt. Uh, try getting a pair of these and uh, see what happens. But uh, yeah, and obviously look after your uh, limbs anyway. Hope you found that useful. Uh, let me know in the comments, I guess. Cheerio.